horses as well, so that. Uh, that nicely done. Did you use the uh, equestrian oh, center? Yes, yes. I love that facility. It's right beautiful. out on spring. Really? Yep. That's great. Yep. That's pretty new. It's a beautiful, yes, it's beautiful. facility. I've, what Close I was to my house. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah. I was actually at the old facility. Our senior class is the last one that has ever known the old facility, so now we see the difference. No, I went to Ohio State. Oh, I used to live. I okay. admit, I used okay. to live basically on campus. I live just right down. You, you know where I used to the White House down there. I think it's yellow now, but uh, but uh, I lived there for quite 25 years. So I right got a couple doors down from the president. I used they, to they run on the. They uh, so well they would yeah. Have yeah. Well, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I used to run on the honor by track, and uh, it's a it's a really a great school. Did you feel? Did all of you feel when you came here? It, it, Eleven to one, I think. Did you feel like people were guiding you through all the time and giving you direction? Did you have that? Or you did? Did you? Absolutely. Yeah, especially when you're a bigger school, or you have a lot of math class with 120 people. So, you know, even though you want to go on email, you know, for health and health and work, you know, it's a lot nicer. Yeah, I've seen some uh, some numbers that were just published about uh, the number of young people graduating from college that are getting jobs, uh, and that are getting jobs that are consistent with their skill level. And it says only about half of America's graduating seniors are able to find work or find work that's up to their uh, their skill. Uh, are you seeing a, a better record than that uh, from Audubon, or uh, are you seeing a lot of folks uh, finding it difficult to find a, a good spot? I feel um, like. Other girls, Lisa and I, and um, only two of us right now actually have a job. And I know a lot of our friends are still currently searching to find a job in different places all over the U.S. Just doing whatever it is that we need to do to get a job. So, no, no. I, I, are you having folks come on campus? Do companies come on campus and recruiters are like, no, no, you're having to go out and, and knock on their doors? Our friends, since it's smaller, we don't have a lot of people. They try and do the best that they can, and they also invite us to some of the stuff that like OU oh, has. We have a website called Ohio Means Jobs. There's probably about 80,000 jobs listed on there where there are openings. So you need to tell your friends, and uh, it's, it's Ohio Means Jobs. And uh, if you look through that, you're going to find uh, a lot of real exciting opportunities. We have 23,000 Chase employees in Ohio, which is really probably shocks you that kind of a number. I know they have openings. I mean, they've had them, you know, and it's, it's, it, I think it's ongoing, but, you know, but there's a lot of really exciting things in the state where you can go and work. You know, you know about the wall and many businesses that are there. But that's why I'm for, you know, for president, because while we're doing much better in Ohio now, the problem is we still have obstacles in our way. This is the man who has a proven record of creating jobs. I mean, he knows he's created jobs, so he knows how to do it. That's what you all want when you get out is to have a chance to have a, you know, realize your hopes and dreams. And uh, that's why it's so important he gets elected because this has been a sputtering, weak, anemic economy. And when you're just coming out of college and you don't have the experience, it's hard. But uh, that's why it matters. That's why I'm here. Yeah, it's been a tough, uh, tough uh, few years for people coming out of college. This year doesn't look any better than the prior years. And uh, that's got to change because folks that can't find work in the first few years coming out of college find that over a long period of time that really affects their, their long term earning potential. So we want to get you to work and get your colleagues to work. Other other experiences? Yeah. Um, I think for me, at least the experience that I've had is a lot of people actually have difficulty finding jobs because the jobs that are there, they don't have a degree. So there's plenty of people that have, I don't know, English degrees, but what are they going to do? Um, and not enough people are going into technology where that's where they need the people, and they need people to know how to work with computers and everything. And 
So from my perspective, at least, like that's what my friends like. I always ask them, like, what do you plan on doing with this? Like, you're one person. There's like 100 people that are looking for this one job. So I just I would like to encourage people to get slightly more practical educations. But yeah. I mean, that's another value of Audubon is that we are a little 